Hello everyone. Welcome to Codewell Tech. Today I will be showing you how to create chart using chart.js library. So chart.js library is open source and using chart.js library you can create pie charts, bar charts, line charts etc. Let's see how to create chart. First we need to download the chart.js library. So go to chart.js organization website. I will mention this link in description and get started and here you can see you can download the latest version of chart.js from github releases or a chart.js cdn so i click on the github releases and here you can see source code zip file and click on it and wait for download it completed download so go to the folder and it is zip file so just extract it so extraction completed and we are now so I am going inside the chart.js 2.9.4 version folder and dist and here you can see chart.min chart and chart.bundle we can take either chart or chart.min version this is minified version which is compressed one this is the source code file which is without minification so I am just taking this I am keeping in the folder where I am going to create the chart now we will see how to create chart using chart.js open the visual studio code i am going to create html file i am going to save this html file where we placed chart.js library name it index.html and now we have html file just with head and body now here i am going to refer the chart.js library so how to refer using script and src chart.js this is the file name create one more file called app.js to write the javascript code app.js so now we have referred chart.js and app.js i am going to refer now we'll see how to create chart so in order to create the chart we need to use the html element canvas so if you already know the canvas that is good otherwise canvas is nothing but html element introduced in the html5 and canvas element is used to draw the graphics and we should write the javascript code to draw the graphics canvas and i am giving some id my bar chart width give 200 height 200 so this is the canvas element and i am going to create a bar chart here i am going to access the canvas element so first we need to get the context of canvas element so let ctx1 equal to document dot get element by id so because we have given id my bar chart dot get context so we need to give this method value 2d and here the actual chart code starts so now to create the chart let my bar chart equal to new chart and this chart is the object which comes from the chart.js library chart will accept two parameters one is element nothing but our context of the canvas the second parameter object and this will contain the all the data that is required to create the chart so here we need to provide data is the property and before that we need to write mention what kind of chart we are going to create so type we need to mention type bar data we will provide the all the required information like labels data sets and data that you are going to show against the labels and background colors and border color border width so first we should mention labels labels here i want to show the temperature details for first three months of the year like january february march so john and here we should write data sets it accept array of objects data so data we should provide that we want to show for these for january let's say 12 15 then 18 before that we should give label that we want to show in the chart using which we can turn on turn off the bars that i will show you in action label 
let's see how graph is coming up right click open with live server we know that using visual studio code first we should open reopen the entire folder and try that right click open with live server our graph is coming here you can see the graph in the purple already showing the data like February label and temperature 15 and same way for March temperature 18 but oops for January it is not showing anything but the label it is showing tem temperature 12 that but the bar is missing why so because these ticks so these 12 13 14 16 17 these are called ticks so these are starting from the 12th means starting value but it should start with 0 then we can see the bar for 12 so since it is starting from the 0 we are not able to see the bar for January month so how to show that here the temperature label is also showing and I told you if you want to turn off you can click this and turn on turn off like that but here how to show the bar for this January and how to make the y-axis start from the zero so in order to make that we should add the property called options so option so then scales again object then y-axis and a should be capital here it accept the array of elements and inside that again object here ticks is a property and inside that we should mention begin at 0 which accept the boolean value true by default it is false so this is how it should be begin at 0 options scales y axis ticks and this option should come after the end of this data property now go and see yes we can see from 0 1 2 3 starting and you can see the bar all. you can see now the chart is occupying entire space of page even more so just press f12 width is 1321 and height is 1321 but we have given 300 i think sorry 200 200 so but it is not applying why so for this also we need to mention one property called responsive and make it false now it is just taken with 200 and height 200 as we mentioned here you can see that we don't have any colors for these bars we can add the color using background color property so these properties are case sensitive so you should give background and c capital means it's following camel case it accept array of values three data values so you have to provide three colors let's say red green blue save it and go and see now you can see red green blue colors and even if you have one two borders you can add the borders also border color orange now we need to mention border width one now we can see so now you can see orange color and yellow color and white color so this is how we can apply the border color and background color this is how we can create the bar chart so if you want pie chart let's say so this is very simple if you want pie chart just copy this my bar chart instead of my bar chart i am giving my pie chart and i just am copying this code my pie chart don't require two and ctx2 and instead of bar i will mention pie so here bar chart and pie chart you can want to read different color different values values also you can change 15 gray color so this is how we can create and if you want to display these two charts next to each other close inside the view so it's not showing in this to each other because somewhere in the chart code so it manually setting display block to the charts so what you need to do we need to strictly apply that important now it will take it yeah. so this is how we can create the chart using chart.js hope you understood the concept please like the video
एंड सब्सक्राइब थैंक यू फॉर